All right, what we're gonna do is talk about wireless and what we can use with wireless and what we can't use with wireless. I, I found out about this like just because the regions in the Pico has restrictions within the, in the headset itself. And there's reasons for that. And the major reason is the, each country has their own laws, okay? And I'll include this uh, information here um, in the link below, like in, a, in the tagged pinned comment. But as, as you can see, all the routers, um, I'm, I'm running, uh, basically I'm running the Chinese Pico uh, account. So I, my region is in China on my headset. So I can't do 160, which I don't think the headset can even do that anyway, even though the Pico helper or extender allows it to 180 or 160. I really don't think it's possible anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But um, if you have it set to channels that aren't within the region, it's going to be prohibited. Okay. So if you go and you look at China, a lot of these channels are prohibited in five gigahertz. You see prohibited, prohibited. So when I ch changed the region, my headset wasn't able to use the, uh, the region. And then like, if you look here, I, you can use channel one through 11 in the United States, but channels one through 13 can be handled in all these other countries. So there's a lot more ability on wireless uh, 2.4 if that's what you're looking for. But the problem with that is you're only limited to 40 on 2.4. So, and it shows that I only can go to 11 on certain routers. But if I, I could set it, you know, like, hey, I'm in, I could just set my area to, you know, like, another region or something like that or actually my my other router probably could because it's you know china i have chinese firmware but anyway um so this is the reason why certain areas are better than other areas when you need to switch the regions as you can see uk italy all these the channels that we were normally 128 um is fine in the UK but then the higher numbers like 157 165 it's prohibited in in the UK Italy Netherlands Switzerland France Germany Belgium and Norway so having this guide here is actually really important to know because this actually helps you know how to set up your router according to your region with your Pico or you can change your region to another country and it should work fine. But as you can see, um, the United States has quite a bit of space. But for some reason with the United States, I was having issues too. But it looks like a lot of these are available. So another thing that's really crazy is the, uh, it's not just the channels that you have available, but the amount of power that can be used for example, in um, Japan, it, it can be um, utilized or whatever else. And one thing I want to check to see is if I set my region in my Pico, if I could set it to Hong Kong and then reboot it, will I still get my Chinese store and be locked into the Chinese, can I still use my Chinese store with the with the thing? And that's one th question I have because I had it on like normal and then all of a sudden my store became the global store, which was weird. Like my store became kind of a global store with a Chinese account, which was kind of weird. So yeah, let's, let's try the Pico Locker and see if, um, if just changing my region would actually help, um, would actually help anything. Let's see, it should work. Um, 
Not sure. Let me unplug and replug. Let me see if it'll. Okay. Let's try again. Oops. No, we don't need it. You okay? And then check device. Okay. Let me reboot my headset and see if that actually changes anything. Because it was like really crazy. Like. Let's go ahead and reboot this thing. Okay. Yeah, it was, it was a little weird. Like, because if I can, if I can actually use, say, this website to, and stay in Ch in UK, even though in Hong Kong, I mean, could I use the Hong Kong location with the Chinese store? And if I can, that's going to be way nice because I can then use all these regions in Hong Kong, which would be really cool. And the, and the reason why I was always staying away from Hong Kong was because in the Pico 3, will it still work? Will my store still work? It's still downloading. Is my friend still working? Yeah, but my, um, let me, let me double check the store. This is weird because if I can check some, like, see if I can add something to my. Cool. It, it's not blocked. Okay, cool. So one other quick now. Oh, this is going to be nice. If I, if I can stay in here. So if you're on Chinese firmware, you'll want to stay on the UK, uh, you want to be able to, yeah, 128. And then 160, save. Okay, perfect. So now I should be able to stay on Wi-Fi with my Chinese, with my global, now it's not showing up which is strange because I do have it set to the UK. I still have it set to uh, Hong Kong, which is kind of crazy. Let's see if it works. Um, let me, let me double check my thing. Let's just check device. It says I'm in UK and it says I should be able to use channel 128. Hong Kong 128. 128 doesn't show up. Okay, so let's try 132. Okay, what's the other one that's lower? Okay, 132, 116. Can I do 116? Okay, so maybe it works now with channel 116 with 160 hertz let's let's double check double check this and see if it comes up it's not showing up cuz xr yeah, it should work at 116, right? See, this is the crazy part because it says 116 is good and then 120 is good. 124 is good. 128 is good. Oh, that's Japan. So 116 and 132. Okay. 116. Okay, is it, and, f okay, perfect, it is working, okay, cool, so I got, I got it on 160, and it is connected to Wi-Fi, and I have the better 160 hertz, this is great, I am going to include this guide, so that you guys can set up your headsets accordingly, I do need the, U I do need Hong Kong for, um, for mine and I believe that the Hong Kong region will work with the China uh, store so that should be fine um, 
That's perfect. That is awesome. Because I mean, look how much prohibited. I couldn't even like, like you can't, I can't do 149 on that. You, you've seen what was happening. Like I can't, yeah, I couldn't use that. I couldn't do any, really anything. So, all right, well, thank you guys for watching. And this is a very, very cool and very, very awesome. And this taught us a lot on how to set up our wireless. This is a really great website. I. I really like this. I'm going to actually favorite it and put it in my toolbar because this is a really cool website. All right. Thanks for watching.